so hello guys today we are talking about the interview experience of value labs so first of all let's talk about the company the company is value labs and the rating you can say like a 3.8 on ambition box and the company is situated in the hyderabad sikandrabad telangana india and uh, the strength of the company is almost 5 to 10,000 employee, right? So today we will talk about the interview questions, especially uh, .NET, senior .NET developer interview questions. Uh, what type of .NET interview questions has been asked in the both the round? I will talk about two rounds interview, both the, are the technical one. So let's start with the round one and after that we will talk about the round two so i have like as usual i have divided our questions in the multiple sections uh like multiple categories of the sections like what are the questions from the c-sharp solid principles and the other stuff related to database as well as well so let's start from the beginning Every interview start with your introduction. So first of all, they will ask you about introduce yourself. So you have to tell about yourself and what is your current role in the company? What exactly you are doing in your com current company and what is your responsibility you have to explain? These are the two common things, the introduction and the current role after that solid principles you have to explain the solid principle in the c-sharp there is a question related to generic they can ask you like what is generic what are the types of generics all that things and how we are using it web api related questions like why we use api and can we create the application without an api if yes then how and if no then why how to make api secure you have to tell all the possible solutions that you can use to secure your api without api can we create the application and uh, what is the need of api that things you have to explain if we go to in dotnet i mean especially in c sharp there are few questions related to entity framework what is entity framework approach database first uh, code first you have to explain both and you have to explain the difference as well examples as well now come to the front end in front end there is question related to angular what are the angular what are the life cycle of angular in the sql they have asked like uh, what is cte common table expressions i hope you know about this so you have to tell about those things you have to explain write a query to add a column not null in a table having thousands records so there can be a uh, sql query related problem as well so here they have asked like uh, uh, write a query uh, to add a column not null in a table already having thousand records now i am jumping to the round two in the round two as usual starting with the introduction so introduce yourself your role what exactly you are doing currently you have to tell all those things obviously uh, the second person the second round persons obviously they have a manager kind of role or they can ask you more and more related to backend or database because those people are the senior people so they can ask you things like that in they have asked like in front end which technology have you used versions especially any experience on the angular one version which dotnet version have you used dotnet core experience you have to tell everything whatever you have used how much time you have used how many years experience do you have on that particular technology what are the different design patterns have you used you have to tell all those things uh, some design patterns are kind of built in and some are uh, 
the new one i mean by default framework will give us so you have to tell everything if you have used some different framework of design pattern then you have to tell those things as well how are you using database calls in your applications you have to tell about that especially the database layer how you are maintaining the things one query sql query based on join they have asked like i mean if you are going for the senior developer positions then obviously especially in full stack developer role they can ask you multiple types of sql queries so here they have asked one query based on join join is a common thing i mean everybody every developer has the knowledge should have a knowledge of join because this is very very important things how can we write the server side paginations this is related to as well sql stored procedures versus function you have to tell the difference between those things if i ask you to write a stored procedure or function which one you will decide to write the query you have to tell that why we use for function why we use stored procedures and which situation we prefer one of them right uh there is one more question related to out of memory ex ex exception basically suppose if we are getting out of memory exception then what are the things you will do what are the things you will do to handle these situations how will you handle this out of memory exception so that it will not happen again how will you do the logging things log things basically how you are maintaining the log log history do you have any generic way to log these things at a top level you have to tell all these things about what is source control are you using in current project you have to tell about that any experience on tfs tfs is basically related to azure uh so most of the persons you who have used and have a knowledge about that so you have to tell about that have you used or not which software engineering model are you using currently i told like um, agile what are the different scrum ceremonies available in your project you have to tell about those things if you are following the different calls over the, like a discussion on the user story then you that is also part of his scrum and uh, that as i you have to tell everything see if you participate in the user story creation i mean these are the questions related to as you have to tell now i am telling you what are the vvip questions like a solid is a vvip questions i am marking these things because this is the vvip questions solid generic is also vvip questions most of the time you will get such, such type of in, in question entity framework approach also been asked many times A angular life cycle is a very very important questions because most of the way if you are going for a 10 interview of the angular then there is a chance of seven to eight times you can get this type of question angular life cycle related ct is also very common and one query you can ask and design pattern yes design pattern is already very generic question and uh, I mean you have to tell whatever design patterns have you used and the next is uh, SQL query and these are the things basically that is the VVIP I hope you enjoyed the video and if you like this content then please share with your friends and uh, subscribe the channel so that you will get notified and such type of contents okay thank you so much let's meet in the another session with the another content